Have you ever wondered if the lost city of Atlantis is more than just a myth? This legendary metropolis, said to have sunk into the sea in a single day and night of catastrophe, has been an object of fascination for over 2,000 years. The philosopher Plato, who first told the tale, described Atlantis as a powerful and advanced kingdom that sank in a night of cataclysm into the Atlantic Ocean around 9,000 years before his own time. But did it really exist? Theories range from the plausible to the outlandish, from an allegorical tale of pride before a fall, to an ancient civilization that had mastered technologies beyond our own. Evidence remains elusive, but the quest for Atlantis has led many explorers to uncover fascinating aspects of our past. Whether fact or fiction, the allure of Atlantis continues to captivate us, reminding us that history often holds more questions than answers. What if Leonardo da Vinci's art hides secrets waiting to be deciphered? This question has intrigued historians and art enthusiasts alike for centuries. Layered within the intricate details of da Vinci's masterpieces, Hidden messages and codes lie in wait, subtly woven into the canvas. These cryptic symbols and signs, often overlooked, are believed to hold the keys to a deeper understanding of the artist's mind and his perception of the world. Take, for instance, the enigmatic smile of the Mona Lisa or the mysterious hand gesture in The Last Supper. These are not mere artistic choices, but deliberate decisions that invite us to look beyond the surface to unlock the secrets da Vinci intended for us to find. The implications of these hidden codes extend far beyond art history. They provide us with a fresh perspective on the genius of da Vinci, reminding us of his multifaceted talents as an artist, a scientist, and a philosopher. The cryptic codes within da Vinci's masterpieces remind us that art, like history, often hides as much as it reveals. What if an ancient text could rewrite our understanding of history but remains indecipherable. Just imagine that for a moment. This is the intriguing premise surrounding the Voynich manuscript. Named after Wilfred Voynich, the Polish book dealer who procured it in the early 20th century, this perplexing document is filled with strange illustrations and an unreadable script that has confounded linguists and cryptographers for over a hundred years. No one has yet managed to crack its code, and the manuscript's origin, purpose and author remain shrouded in mystery. Despite the countless hours, sleepless nights and countless theories, we're still no closer to understanding the secrets it holds. The potential impact of this document on our understanding of the past is immense. If only we could decode its cryptic pages. The Voynich Manuscript, a riddle wrapped in a mystery inside an enigma, stands as a testament to the enduring allure of the unknown. What if a secret society wielded influence over the course of European history? This question brings us to the enigmatic world of the Rosicrucians, a secret society that thrived in the shadows, shaping pivotal historical moments from the Renaissance to the Enlightenment. Their beliefs, a blend of Christian mysticism, alchemy and philosophy, left an indelible mark on Europe's intellectual landscape. The Rosicrucians were believed to possess esoteric knowledge that they used to guide societal evolution. They were seen as architects of a new era, promoting freedom of thought, humanism and scientific exploration. Their influence spread across Europe, impacting fields as diverse as art, literature and science. Figures like Sir Francis Bacon, René Descartes and Isaac Newton were all thought to have been influenced by Rosicrucian ideas. The influence of the Rosicrucians serves as a potent reminder that history is often shaped by forces hidden from view. Their legacy serves as a testament to the power of secret societies in shaping our world. Could the legendary King Arthur have been a real historical figure? The Arthurian legend, filled with tales of chivalry, magical swords and round table knights, has been etched into our cultural consciousness. Yet there's an ongoing debate among historians. Was there a real King Arthur behind these stories? Evidence is scarce and often shrouded in the mists of time, but some historical records hint at a powerful leader who united Britain against invading forces around the 5th or 6th century. This figure, possibly named Arthur, could be the inspiration behind the legendary king. However, it's not just about identifying a historical figure. The Arthurian legend has shaped our understanding of medieval history, influencing literature, art and even politics. 
These tales have been used to instill values, promote national identity, and even legitimize royal lineage. The enduring legend of King Arthur reminds us that history and myth often intertwine, each shaping the other in profound ways. Could some of the world's ancient wonders be the result of extraterrestrial influence? This question has given rise to a controversial set of theories suggesting that ancient civilizations may have had encounters with visitors from other planets. Supporters of these theories point to a range of evidence. This includes the construction of architectural marvels like the pyramids, which some argue exhibit a level of knowledge and precision that seems beyond the capabilities of their time. They also reference curious artifacts and ancient artwork that appear to depict beings or technologies not of this world. Critics, however, caution against interpreting the past through the lens of our current technological understanding. They argue that such theories can undervalue the ingenuity and innovation of our ancestors. Regardless of where you stand, the debate surrounding ancient alien theories challenges us to broaden our perspectives on history and the possibilities of the universe. Of what stories might we discover if we looked past the traditional narratives of history? As we turn the pages back, we find a trove of remarkable women whose stories have been overlooked or forgotten. These are the hidden women of history, the unsung heroines who defied societal norms, changed rules, and left an indelible mark on the world. From the scientific brilliance of Hypatia of Alexandria, an ancient philosopher who was centuries ahead of her time, to the military prowess of Joan of Arc, a teenager who led an army to victory, History is brimming with these extraordinary women. Consider the daring exploits of Harriet Tubman, an abolitionist who risked her life for the freedom of others, or the literary genius of Mary Shelley, who penned the world's first science fiction novel. The hidden women of history remind us that every voice has the power to shape the world, even if it's not always heard. What if the circumstances surrounding Mozart's death aren't as clear as we thought? This brilliant composer who gifted us with masterpieces that still resonate today died at the young age of 35. Officially, Mozart's cause of death is recorded as severe miliary fever. But many have questioned this account. Conspiracy theories abound, with some suggesting foul play. One such theory implicates rival composer Antonio Salieri in a deadly plot. Though historians largely dismiss this as dramatic myth, but the suddenness of Mozart's illness, his rapid decline, and his premature death have all fueled speculation. Could it have been an exotic disease, or perhaps even poisoning? The truth remains elusive, yet these mysteries only enhance our fascination with Mozart, adding an extra layer of intrigue to his extraordinary life. The mystery surrounding Mozart's death reminds us that even in death, great figures continue to fascinate their lives and deaths becoming stories in their own right.